We are live in Mississauga where Peel police are on scene of a developing situation here near Mavis and Eglinton. Now this is one of a number of scenes. They are still on the hunt for a man who they believe shot a woman and then took off in a Peel police cruiser. Now it all started actually just down the street uh, in a, on another street past the park called Apple Blossom. Police believe that a man and a woman were having a fight and the woman was shot. And I didn't look, but I just heard the guy scream that he got attacked and he's bleeding first. And then as I was entering the house, I heard the gunshot go. I didn't want to believe that it was a gunshot. I was like, this cannot be it. This couldn't be happening like 20 steps away from where I'm standing. She was on the floor screaming and she was bleeding very badly and there were people helping him. They called 911 and they said the ambulance on the way, but it took time. But we could see she was in so much pain. She was taken to hospital in non life threatening injuries. That male suspect ended up here, and that is where there was a bit of an altercation with police. Uh, police uh, tried to tussle him to the ground. There was an attempt to tase him, but that man managed to get away and then hopped into a Peel police cruiser and took off. Now, we spoke with one witness about what he saw. Here's what he told us. He, he wasn't cooperating, and then the cop decides to tase, pull out his taser and uh, decides to tase him. Um, after that, the suspect decides to hop into the cop car and drive off. As he was doing that, the cop pulls out his gun and tries to stop him from getting away by shooting his tires. Unfortunately, he missed, and then the suspect is, uh, ended up getting away. Do you think? Honestly, man, it, it felt like a movie scene. I've never seen this in my life. Um, I was just in shock, like I was frozen, I don't know what to do. I just, I don't know if I should have helped or not, but uh, my instinct was to just stay, stay out, of the, out of the way and let the cop do his job. Now, police confirmed that that cruiser was hit by bullets. And what you're looking at here is a dent in a truck on this street. It seems that that man hit that car with the cruiser on his way out of here. Now, he didn't get very far. That cruiser was found about 12 minutes away from here on Idle Wild Crescent. Uh, it appears that that suspect then got into another stolen vehicle. And that vehicle was found in Toronto near uh, the 401 and Martin Grove. So police are still looking for that suspect. The only description they have is a black male with white tennis shoes. It's unclear if he is on foot or in another vehicle, although police say they haven't heard any indications of any other stolen vehicles related to this situation. So this scene still unfolding here. Police still hunting for that suspect after one woman was shot in Mississauga uh, and uh, the suspect getting away in a police cruiser and now still uh, at large. We'll bring you any details we have on this developing story as uh, we get them.